very good morning, a very warm welcome to episode 24 of Golden Moments. And this week's Golden Moments is focusing on our Prevent programme, which is something we've engaged very heavily with since the beginning of this academic year way back in September. It's the way in which we work in conjunction with West Midlands uh, Police Service to enable students to protect themselves and ensure that they are not at risk of violent extremism. And in a moment I'm going to hand over to Mr Bruce, who is the Vice Principal here at Golden Hillock, who's also our Prevent Manager, and he'll be giving you a little bit more in the way of information about Prevent and how it is we work with the Police Service to ensure that students are prepared for the world in which they live. We've done a number of things to further the Prevent strategy this year in Golden Hillock, that is, to prevent students from becoming radicalised towards violent extremism. We started early in the year with whole school assemblies to explain what the prevent strategy was and back this up with a specialist group talking about the issues, particularly focused on the issues around Syria and Iraq. And we gained support from our local police service and the prevent team in doing that. Recently we wanted to look at the vulnerability young people are exposed to regarding the internet, using their phones, text messages and so on and we prepared a form time activity where students imagined they were writing a text message to somebody they knew who was vulnerable towards um, radicalisation or thinking about going to Syria. I'm now going to hand over to Tim Baker who's going to explain what the activity was about. Hello, I'm Tim Baker. Last week in form time, we had an activity where several of our students would write a text message to their friends in order to persuade them not to go to Syria because of all the disadvantages. Now, we're going to have several of our students reading out which text messages they would have sent to their friends. Meet up after school. Let's go film club. I was worried when you were talking about Syria earlier. You're not thinking of going, are you? We all hear about you. Your mom and sis would cry too much. You can't do that to them. Okay, shame about those Syrian refugees. We should do an appeal for Oxfam. What do you say? Don't go there. It's only going to be troubled. You can help more by raising money here. Don't wreck up your life. Syria is a one way trip. You get me? Don't do it. Those guys are real bad Muslims. My, my Imam says they are terrorists. You don't want to be with them. Oh, my name is Safwan. By the way, as you guys are wondering why we're not in school uniform, it's because today is Friday the 13th of March. And due to comic relief, Many of us have chosen not to wear school uniform of the less fortunate people living in poor areas. There are many activities going on today in school. For example, at, at lunchtime, there's a talent show. And at break, a cake sale, and etc. This text message activity was totally imaginary. But we felt it would help to build re resilience amongst the youngsters that if they ever did find anybody they knew thinking about going to Syria, they would know how to dissuade them. Thank you very much Mr Bruce and thank you to the students in particular. You've clearly heard from our students there the way in which they are able to articulate in a very coherent way the way in which they themselves are obviously protecting themselves against some of the risks that they're exposed to and not just that but also how they're able to work in partnership with the police service to ensure that other students are protected from being at risk of violent extremism in this ever challenging and ever changing world in which we live. Um, but for this week's Golden Moments it's a very goodbye and we look forward to seeing you again next week for episode 25.